Now a developing story, RIT has selected the architect to build its new hockey arena as both the men's and women's hockey programs at RIT go Division 1, they need more space. Tina Shively tells us about the plans. RIT's hockey program is growing, so much so that they've outgrown the building here behind me, Ritter Arena. Today, the school announced they've chosen the company who will help put an end to that problem and build them a brand new place to play. RIT's search committee chose Toronto-based yeah, BBB Architects to build the brand new Gene Policini Center. The firm was one of four finalists with an impressive resume. And they really target individual solutions to their clients. So they, they've done some innovative things. They've had great success in sports arenas. Um, they are currently in the process of helping to remodel uh, Madison Square Garden in New York City. And they're also responsible for the architecture of uh, Air, the Air Canada Center in Toronto. You're looking at pictures of RIT's current stadium, Ritter Arena. It can only accommodate 2,100 fans. Stella says the recent success of both the men's and women's Division I hockey teams are drawing more and more fans every year. Many miss out when the games get sold out. The new center will hold more than double what can fit inside Ritter Arena, somewhere between four and 5,000 fans. RIT hopes its hockey teams will be able to drop the puck at the brand new Gene Policini Center by the 2013-2014 season. At RIT, Tina Shively, News 8. Tina says BBB will now come up with renderings for this new arena, and that will help RIT decide which of the three possible locations on campus where it will be built.